Two seasons in a row, the Wisconsin basketball Badgers made it to the final four this year playing in the national championship game for the first time since 1941. It was indeed a season to remember for Coach Bo Ryan and his players, and now you can relive it all. A new book, Make Them Believe, the inside story of the Badgers' road to the 2015 Final Four it goes on sale this week, and its author is the Assistant Director for Athletic Communications for the basketball team, Patrick Erb, joining us today on Live 5. Welcome. Thank you. This is well, quite a season. It really was. It, I mean, the two-year run is historic, something that we've never seen around here before, and, and this year's team in particular just kind of captured everybody's hearts, both with how successful they were on the court and the unique, endearing personalities that kind of made up this year's team. It was, it was pretty special. Do you think that's what it was, the personalities that really set the team, you know, apart from so many other teams? Absolutely. I, we've had good Wisconsin teams, but this one kind of transcended the state borders a little bit that I think America kind of fell in love with this team a little bit because of their goofy nature and their down to earth. They seemed like guys that we would want to hang out with, right? Mm -hmm. And they really were. That's that was genuine. That's who they were. And and so the, the fact that they had this ability to live in the moment and enjoy the experience and have fun with it and be playful, but at the same time, get on the basketball court and turn it on and be, you know, assassins on the basketball court <laughs> was really endearing. And I think a lot of people love that about this team. You know, when a project like this comes along, you usually, okay, the season's starting, I'm gonna write this all down because I'm gonna do a book at the end of the year, but it didn't turn out that way. No, this was a little bit of a unique project in that way. I. Prior to the season, everybody knew that this team could be really good. They were preseason top five and had come off a of Final Four. And one of the former players on the team, Zach Bohannon, actually gave me a journal before the season started, a uh, thoughtful kid that he is, and said, you may want to keep notes on this year's team because if they're as good as we think they are, you're going to want to write a book about it. So I kept some notes during the season. After the season's over, took a few weeks off work basically to hammer this out, and we wanted to have it out by Father's Day and, and kind of... Uh, Fast track this story and, and get it to get it to Badger fans as soon as possible. So you started this like three weeks after the Final Four, and now here it is. <laughs> Pretty here much, it yeah. This, uh, it was it was a rush job, and uh, and it's it's filled with a lot of unique Great stories. Pictures. And these are you know some pictures that, that people have never seen before, like Nigel Hayes being buried up to his head <laughs> in sand, uh, and it, it it chronicles both the highlights of the season in terms of big wins, like winning a Big Ten championship or beating Kentucky and Indianapolis, like everyone will remember, but also the backstory on what makes these guys special and how they got along, and, and it's filled with anecdotes from behind the scenes and kind of conversations in the locker room and things like that that I'm privileged to have access yeah. to in my mm -hmm. job. Did you have a favorite moment of the season that you shared in the book? Or do we have to read the book? Yeah. <laughs> we know how it ends. We know how it ends. We'll just give some spoiler alerts. Uh, the Kentucky game is, I think, the crowning moment of yeah. the season, the beating Kentucky, the undefeated team, and advancing to the first national championship since 1941. It was a lot of fun to write that chapter and go back and watch the game, talk to the players about it. Um, but I, I think some, some of my favorite moments were the guys behind the scenes. Uh, the trip that we took back from Maryland, where we had plane trouble and had to make an emergency right. landing in Pittsburgh, while it was cloaked in a uh, kind of maybe sort of harrowing travel experience, it was fun to get that time with the guys away from being serious and away from basketball and kind of be able to see their, their bond and their connection. Same for our trip to the Bahamas uh, around Thanksgiving for the Battle for Atlantis tournament, to see these guys interact with each other, bury each other in the sand mm -hmm. and play in the water. <laughs> great players. As a, yeah, as great opposed players and to. Great guys. Yeah, absolutely. That, that's what made this team special. You can pre-order the book at kcisports.com, 1-800-697-3756. It'll be in stores, bookstores yep. later this week. Yeah, it'll be in Barnes & Noble, UW Bookstore, et cetera, around the Madison area later this week. So exciting. It's a beautiful book. I, I love thumbing through it. Yeah. Appreciate it. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Thanks for coming out today. Thank you.